So thanks to um, Zhao's directions and recommendation, I was able to find this restaurant behind me. Um, so the name of this restaurant is called Ming Lan. It's actually a very famous chain of seafood restaurants specializing in Rakhine State cuisine. So Rakhine State is a northern state in Burma. Their seafood is apparently very well known and their style of cooking is very chilly. Uh, but it's not, it's chilly, but it's not too oily or fatty, so you don't feel too bad afterwards. At least that's what I read, so I hope it's true. All right, so I've got a menu here. Fresh seafood and rakim food. Philosophy of mainland, safe and secure. That's good. I, I don't want to get food poisoning from this. Uh, let's see what they got in terms of seafood. Oh, they got crab. Now, I don't mind crab, but it's just so hard to eat. Like, the effort to, you know, flavor ratio is not good enough. Soft shell, I would consider soft shell crab. See, mixed seafood. Oh my god, look at that. That looks so good. I, I don't even know what it is, but it looks so good. Oh my god, look at that. Okay, let's see what else they got. Mantis stream. Oh, I think I'm gonna get some of that. That looks they look huge. Oh, okay. So if I really want to go all in, uh, lobster is where it's at. It's a shame they don't have price tags. I really want to know how much they are before I commit. But I'm really keen to get the lobster. How much is this? 60. 60, okay. Uh, how much is uh, how much is this? 16. 8,500. 5,000. 8,500, okay. I realized I need some carbs to go along with seafood, so I was looking at the salad. Now, you know I hate salads, but what in Burma, I think when they say salad, they mean more like a noodle, like a mixed noodle. So you can see here that you choose the noodle, fresh rice noodle, but it's called a salad. So I think I'm gonna go for this one because this one says too spicy, so I'm gonna pass. All right, so everything it has arrived. So first up, we got the roasted or barbecued uh, bamboo clams. This one is a prawn curry. They warned me this one's a little spicy. Um, this one is barbecued tiger prawns. Look how massive they are. My only pet peeve is they, they didn't peel it. Well, I don't, I don't like peeling prawns. I just wish they kind of peeled it for me. And lastly, for some carbs, uh, so this is a noodle salad. It's really, only really salad because I guess it's cold and they're kind of mixing a bunch of different things. But for all intents and purposes, I would call it just a noodle. All right, so it's time to dig in. All right, so we're gonna start off with the chilliest thing on the menu. So this is a tiger prawns. Definitely a little bit spicy, but not too bad. Um, it's not that spicy, it's a little numbing on the tongue, but otherwise perfectly good. The prawns are very tender. Try the bamboo clam. Get a whole big piece here. Very good, um, a little bit charred. A little garlic flavor, which I do like. So some people don't like the garlic flavor. Bamboo clam is a little bit chewy, so it's a little bit harder to eat, but the texture is quite good. Now for the tiger form. So this might take a while because I don't like peeling. But I'll just peel a little bit off. Enough so I can take a decent bite out of it. Look at that. That's all the eggs, I think. Mm. Oh. They gave me this sauce. I'm going to try dipping the sauce. Mm. Oh, the, sauce. <coughs> the sauce is a little chilly, so be careful. Um, but it's barbecued really well. The prawn is so big, like this is a solid three biter. Most most times I eat prawns as a one bite thing. This is a solid three biter. And it's very tender, it's barbecued very nicely. So lastly, we got this noodle salad. Um, yes, I've been warned this one's spicy. It doesn't look red at all, but I've been told it's really spicy. Let's try it out. Okay, that 
weren't they weren't joking. This is very spicy. <laughs> it's like I think it's like jalapenos, but I did not expect this one to be that spicy. <coughs> um, the spice aside, uh, it's just very clear noodles. I think it's good for a summer's day. Uh, it's very cold. Um, <laughs> can't get over the spiciness. So that was a really, really good meal. Um, Minlan has quite a few branches around Yangon, so you didn't have to come out as far as I did just to try out the great seafood. Uh, but the reason I came out here is because this branch of Minlan is right next to this massive lake known as Inya Lake, which is what you see right here. And you can see just how big it is if I s scroll past the horizon. It's a very, very big lake. And as you can see here, it's a very popular place for um, local Burmese people to come uh, take an evening stroll and play around with the kids. 